In today's video, let us discuss about the difference between IMCV and a contactor. It's a very important topic asked in most of the electrical interviews. The abbreviation of MCV is Miniature Circuit Breaker. From the abbreviation, we can say that MCV is a circuit breaker in a miniature form. Now, let us see how an MCV looks like. This is how an MCV looks like. We can say that the operation of an MCV and a circuit breaker both are same. It protects a circuit from faulty conditions. As it's a miniature form of a circuit breaker, so the rating of this is limited. The ampere rating of this is below 100 amps. If a system is drawing below 100 amps, we use an MCB to protect the circuit. If the system is drawing more than 100 amps, we does not use an MCB. Now let us talk about a contactor. Contactor is an electromagnetic switching device. That is a contactor simply acts as a switch. But it is not an mechanical switch. It is not a mechanical switch. For example, this is also a switch, but it's a mechanical switch. Contactor is not like a mechanical switch. It operates like a switch, but it's not a mechanical switch. It is an electromagnetic switch. The word electromagnetic is very important. Due to this electromagnetic feature, we can use a contactor to automate our system. That is, a contactor is used to automate or remotely operate any system. Let's understand the word automate and remotely operating a system. Automate means consider any load such as your motor or light or your basic pump. Basically, any load we need not manually on or off them. We can automate this on and off future by using an PLC or a relay. So by using a contactor, we can automate any system. Now the word remotely means operating any load from a remote location. Consider, for example, you have a water pump at your field or below your apartment. You need not go to the location of your motor to turn it on or off. But you can do it by sitting at your home. In this case, you are remotely operating your water pump from your home. This is called remotely operating any system. By using a contactor, you can automate the system as well as you can remotely operate any system. But remember one important point. Contactor does not provide you any protection to the circuit. Contactor does not provide any protection to the circuit. So we have to use a relay such as overload relay along with a contactor to get protection. Now let's quickly recap what have we learned in this section. The difference between a MCB and a contactor is it's a circuit breaker but in a miniature form. A very important point, MCB protects the circuit from any fault that is from short circuit faults and overload. So it's basically an protection device. MCB is an miniature form of circuit breaker so it is used in systems whose ampere rating is less than 100 amps. So the system below 100 amps only uses MCB. Now coming to a contactor, contactor is a switching device. Contactor does not provide any protection to the circuit. So it is not an protection device. Contactor is not an mechanically operated switch. So it can be used to automate or remotely operate any system. These are the basic differences of a contactor and an NCB. That's all for today. If you like the video, please do like, share, subscribe the channel. This is Sandeep Shaktri signing off.